Welcome to Current 2.0, a major update to our virtual instrument. In this series of videos, we'll explore the synth and make it easy for you to start creating. Together, we'll take a look at all of the synthesizer's functionality, including its engines, the effect rack, and the all-new PlayView. First, let's get into the basics and look at Current's UI. Current 2.0 is broken up into four views. The play view, the engine view, the effects, and the stream. You can quickly navigate between the four sections using the tabs found on the left side of Current's UI. Under the navigational tabs, you'll find four macro knobs. These are freely assignable macro knobs and are great for controlling many parameters at once. You'll notice as you explore through our presets, these macros are already assigned. It's a great way to totally morph your sounds in interesting ways. At the top of the plugin is the main toolbar. You can toggle tooltips on and off, check your account info, and see if there are updates available via the notifications icon. In the middle of the toolbar, you can navigate presets by using the preset selector. Or by clicking the preset selector, you open the preset pop-up menu, which allows for a deeper search. To the right are the Synth's global settings, save preset button, and cloud connection status. Now let's take a look at some of what's new in Current 2.0. The Play View is a new way to add expressive performance to your sounds. We'll cover this in detail in the next video, but let's have a listen to a few presets and play around with the XY pad. Another new feature is the Mod Matrix. Quickly dial in all of your modulation connections in one place and tweak your patches just how you want them. Let's hop over to the newly added Mixer panel and check out some of the functionality there. Here, you have control over each engine's gain, direct output options, and more. In the effects view, you'll see nine total effects, including the new frequency shifter effect called Wave Shifter. Here's a quick demo of how that sounds. We'll go over it in more detail later. Another cool feature we've added is the ability to see the frequency spectrum of the wavetables. You can navigate to it in the engine view, here. We've also added a lot of enhancements to the plugin, including a new content library with over 400 presets, a redesigned dark mode UI, and a number of optimizations. Current 2.0 is available now. You can grab it on the site or trial it for 30 days with all access. 
If you'd like to learn more about Current 2.0, check out the next video in our walkthrough series where I'll go over the ins and outs of the PlayView.